Don't you know how to use Data Slayer with Looker Studio? Don't worry, we are going to explain it to you. The first thing is to create a new report. Here we can see all the data sources we can connect, and we are going to search for Data Slayer. For this example, I am going to choose Google Ads. Then you just have to authenticate your Google account and just follow the steps. Here you select the accounts with which you want to work and the different filters you want to see. And in this section, we have extra options to personalize our query, like maximum rows or number of decimals. All the options that are on the right will allow us to view and modify them in the looker itself without having to return to this screen. We click add, and this would be the most difficult part. The rest is normal looker studio operation. We are going to modify the dimensions and metrics. We can also sort, filter, and indicate a date range. Then we can modify our looker, changing the theme, adding a date range control, and we select another date range, changing the data displayed in the table. Then we could import a line graph. In the same report, we can add data from other sources. And we just have to follow the authorization process. Then follow the same process, customizing it as we want. Then we can select the source we have included and configure the metrics as we want. That's how easy and quick it is to have the information you need with Data Slayer.